Hello, this is Andy Ford Video with an After Effects basic tutorial. We'll look at ways to manipulate layers in your composition. First, let's talk about changing the order of your layers. Sometimes when you create or paste layers in After Effects, they don't always go in the order that you had hoped. If you have a few layers and want to invert the order so that the bottom layer goes on top, the top layer goes on the bottom, there's an easy way to do this. First, select the layers you want to invert and then cut. This is Command X on the Mac or Control X on the PC. Then paste the layers back, which is Command V on the Mac or Control V on the PC. Now the layer order has been flipped. To move layers up or down, simply highlight the layer and select Command Alt and Down Arrow or Control Alt Down Arrow on the PC, and this will move your layer down by one. The same command with the up arrows moves your layer up by one. Also on a Mac, I use Command plus right bracket or Command plus left bracket to do the same thing. If you do Command Shift left bracket or Control Shift left bracket, you can move your selected layer to the bottom of the composition. Do that same command with the right bracket and you can move the layer you have selected to the top of the composition. If you want to sequence layers so that layer two comes in after a certain number of frames after layer one and layer three comes in a few frames after layer two, there's an easy way to do that. With your layer starting at the same time, select them all, move the time indicator to the duration you want the sequence to be. Then trim all the layers down to this duration using the Alt and right bracket or Option and right bracket command. Now that they're trimmed to the duration you want, just right click on one of the highlighted layers and select Keyframe Assistant and then Sequence Layers. Just hit OK to space your layer starting points to the amount of frames you just selected, or if you want to have overlap, select the Overlap checkbox and enter a number of frames for that overlap. Then simply change the endpoint of your layers back to your desired duration using the Alt and right bracket or Option and right bracket command. To simply move layers in time, left bracket moves the starting point of a layer and the right bracket moves the endpoint of a layer. Remember this does not trim but rather shifts the entire layer to start or end at that point in time. Finally, let's look at splitting a layer. To split a layer into two parts, move your time indicator to the desired time and select Command plus Shift plus D or Control Shift D on a PC to split the layer at that point. So hopefully this helps make working with layers easier. Thank you.